welcome back it is day 12 here it is jackie hello hello uh i thought i would check in with you guys first of all i'm sorry i did not make the lemon ginger blast recipe today for this video i am going to do it tomorrow i have a valid excuse <laughs> so we got up this morning we went to the gym and I decided to walk today instead of doing a weight training workout because mainly I'm just still kind of sore and I feel like just getting back into it maybe two days is plenty this week and then next week I'll do three and then be consistent with three workouts a week it is Friday today uh, so I thought I'd wear my Friday shirt because I'm in a good mood again. Still not a ton of energy. Not super motivated today. It is so crappy out here today. It's like pouring down rain. It rained all night last night. It's, it's on the warmer side, but I think tomorrow the temperatures are supposed to drop. So that will be interesting. Like negative temps and maybe some snow. But uh, I did make it to the grocery store and stocked all up. So I have no excuses not to juice. And I have my tea ready because I know I'm going to want something warm and comforting. And instead of soup, I'm going to have tea. So I'm all prepared. But so I got home and I needed to go to the grocery store because I didn't, I wasn't organized enough yesterday to get my Walmart order ready and then delivered. So I went to the grocery store, I got back and I made my celery juice and I drank it. And then I started to film it. And then I remembered that I was supposed to go and do a haircut for this little lady that I do. She's a client, a long-term client of mine and she lives in assisted living now and it hit me that I was supposed to go. So I had to hurry up and make my lemon ginger blast cause she had a doctor's appointment and I couldn't be late normally. She's really flexible, but uh, she wasn't today. So that's why I did not make it, but I will make it tomorrow morning. I kind of have an overall plan of how I'm going to do it. I don't know how much chatting I'm going to do. I think I'm just going to make the juice and I might make it into a short. I'm thinking about doing that just for something different to do, but then also putting it in the video. So today I'm not, still not quite as energetic as I would like to be, but I'm still in a really good mood. I have noticed that I am feeling a little sensitive to the touch. So like when I touch myself, I like, or what, <laughs> that sounds really bad, but when I push on my shoulders or whatever, I'm like chilling really bad. So I don't know if any of you have done this and you feel like your skin is more sensitive, like you feel more, if that makes sense. Does that make sense to anyone? I don't know. It could just be all in my mind, but I, I am interested if anyone who's done, done a juice cleanse feels like that, then comment down below and let me know I'm not losing my mind. Uh, <laughs> um, also, uh, what else? Oh, the husk and the clay. So I started that last night and I haven't really noticed any difference in my digestion today. Uh, I'm still going to the bathroom. It really hasn't changed at all. Um, as far as frequency or, you know, like it's supposedly it's supposed to make your poop more solid, but it really hasn't done that. So I was supposed to do that again this morning. So with the husk and the clay protocol, my particular protocol, you're supposed to start with a teaspoon of each a day. And then you go up to that twice a day. Then you go up to two teaspoons once a day, then to twice a day, up to three teaspoons once a day, then to twice a day, and then you quit. So you do basically six days and then you go off of it again for like five to seven days and then you start again. So I did miss that this morning because I just wasn't really feeling like drinking it. It didn't taste bad, but I don't know. You know that when you're drinking powder, just sometimes choking it back is hard to do. So I'm gonna do the teaspoon of each again tonight and then kind of start all over or I'll just do it up to the sixth day and then I'll, I'll lay off for five or six days but mainly that's it I'm not super productive today I've been watching a lot of uh, John Rose videos and just kind of laying around mainly I did take a little nap this afternoon but my juice I've been drinking it uh, way better today is when you, you work with your hands it's really hard sometimes to just be chronically drinking uh, water anything but I've always struggled with that as a hairdresser so 
uh, I decided today that I needed to start drinking more during the day because when I drink later into the evening then I had to get up to go to the bathroom in the middle of the night to go pee so it disrupts your sleep. I mean last night I was able to go right back to sleep uh, and I probably I feel like last night was my best night's sleep since beginning this just I wasn't restless at all I wasn't hot at all I slept really sound I felt like before I would have these crazy dreams and I'd wake up and I'd go back to sleep and then in the morning I was like, did I really wake up or was I dreaming that I woke up? <laughs> Confusing. Um, so yeah, I will uh, check back in with you guys. Tomorrow I will make the lemon ginger blast so that you can see how much goes into the 68 ounce pitcher, how much of each item I use. And uh, my pineapple juice is still amazing. I did get some cantaloupes because I thought I would do one of those this morning after my weight training workout but i didn't do it so i didn't make my cantaloupe juice and yeah i'm still not like hungry i don't really have an appetite it's so crazy to think that i have not been eating solid food and i'm not hungry i mean everyone says that's gonna happen but you just don't believe it till you do it it's weird it's weird not to be hungry though last night i did make my husband's dinner for him jordan's dinner consisted of uh pasta and uh, I sauteed some mushrooms for him to go in the pasta and then I made him a big salad and sourdough bread. He did that himself. So it did smell really good last night. So I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do that for the next couple of days, but it's the weekend so he can make his own stuff now, but he has been working really late. So I've been trying to make his dinner and I've made it for him like three times. And last night was the first time that it's really bothered me. It smelled really yummy, but I didn't cave. I drank my juice. I went and sat on the couch while he was eating and I drank my juice and all was well. I, I, it's not like I was hungry, but it just smelled yummy. But when I think about eating, I think, no, I don't really want to eat. If I did, I would feel like, well, that was stupid because I wasn't hungry enough to even do it. And like I said, I don't like to quit things that I start. So. Okay guys, I will see you tomorrow. I hope you have a good rest of your evening and uh, like, comment, subscribe. I think that's what you're supposed to say at the end of these. Have a good night.